what is going on you guys today is the day today is the day will i pass or will i fail my motorcycle driving test we'll see hey guys uh so i just want to say in advance that i'm sorry for the crappy audio in this video uh, I normally strive for good audio, but I was in a hurry. Uh, it was the morning of my DMV um, motorcycle test, so I was just in a hurry trying to get my mic in the other helmet, and I put the mic in exactly the same place as I do my regular vlogging helmet, and for whatever reason, it just sounded like crap. So I apologize, so just bear with me through the video. You know, I really appreciate you guys watching. And uh, I think you guys know that, so uh, enjoy. All right, guys. So I have an hour-long ride to get to where I need to be going <laughs> for my DMV test. Oh my God! I'm not gonna lie. I'm nervous. I am. Uh, I'm pretty nervous. This morning I had the I had the nervous poops a couple times, and I don't know. It's like it's like I shouldn't be nervous for the test, but. I'm just nervous for the test. I mean, I, I haven't been tested in anything for years and years and years. So, I don't know, just the fact that somebody is watching your every move and critiquing you, you know, that really shouldn't bother me too much because I had an ex-co-worker who was like that. He was a dick. Anyway, uh, I have sweet Siri whispering in my ear my coordinates, my directions where I need to go. And if you couldn't tell, actually the sun's to my back, so you probably can't see that well. But I have my OG helmet. This is the helmet that I first started vlogging in. But I have a, a new mic set up in here, so hopefully, you know, hopefully the audio is okay. This is my long distance helmet because it's a lot quieter than my uh, my other one and so this morning when I was getting the bike ready and everything I put the DB killer back in because I don't want to be failed right off the bat for you know, having a bike that's too loud or you know something like that Ugh. I'm just I'm just trying to cover all my bases uh, I'm nervous guys I'm nervous. The other thing about it is I gotta see if they're even gonna let me record the test. I know some places do, some places don't, so we're just gonna have to see. Oh, guys. All right. I have an hour long ride, so I don't wanna kill my battery. So I'll catch you in just a little bit. Just a little bit. Bye-bye. Alrighty guys, we are here. Woo. How you doing? How's it going? Good. Here for your road test? Yeah. Dude, it's easy. Is it? Just make sure you always look over, bro. Like they they really want you to look over your blind spots, you know. Oh, okay. Like they'll have you they'll have you pull over on the side of the road, he's gonna make you stop. Before you take off, just make sure you look before you take off. Oh, okay. And he'll have you do a little U-turn. You know, you have you pull over first before you start your U-turn. Look over, then do your U-turn, then you pull over right away, and then he'll stop and do his like little shit on his paper. Okay. And then uh, he'll let you know when it's good again, when you can keep continue. Before you pull off again, look over your shoulder. Okay. It just it's mostly if you miss if you miss looking over your shoulder for the blind spot, your iMac fail. Really? Yeah. Yeah. And he'll still have you continue the test, but you're you basically failed. I got gotcha. you. Make sure you stop before the white line. Okay. And uh, 
that's about it. And make sure you use your turn signal. He got me in like one time I missed my turn signal. Okay. That, that's it. See, I was wondering because when I, I did a Google Earth and I'm like, I don't see any... He took you down there? No, um, this is the first time I'm doing one. Right. And normally I've always seen him like in a parking lot with like yeah, cones or yeah. stuff. Yep, yep, I know what you're talking about. So uh, he actually kind of rides like with you? Harley and stuff. Oh, okay. Go through Harley classes. Yeah. Those are like, fuck, three, dude. $400. Yeah, yep. But, uh, yeah, dude, it's super, super easy. Just always watch your blind spot. Always look for your blind spot. I'll have you do it even a inner, uh, lane change. Look over, you know, make sure you cock your head. You want you like oh, yeah. whiplash, you know. Okay, yeah. And, uh, but it, it, it's easy. Nice. Yeah. It's easy, though. It's super nice. easy. Nice. I, I was nervous, nervous, you know. It's yeah. nervous. You're really nervous, <laughs> yeah. too. Oh, but, yeah. But it, it's, I, it's a super How does that microphone easy. fit in your helmet? I don't, I don't it's mean, a little earpiece. Just a little oh. earpiece. And you wear the vest. Oh, okay. And, Can I have my visor open? Sure. Right okay. Now. Yeah. Can you hear me? Can you still hear me? Yes. Still hear me? Yep. Okay. That's cool. We have a camera in front of those. Yeah. About? Do you mind if I record for my uh, YouTube channel? I do mind. Okay. Alright guys, so I'm not sure if any of my beginning of my damn vlog recorded. See, I'm not sure if uh, any of the beginning of my vlog recorded because uh, uh, I got to the DMV and I thought I hit off. I thought I was in sequence, but um, it was still like recording, so I don't know if I recorded anything. I guess we'll see uh, when I go to edit, huh? But I know it was recording up until the point where I asked if uh, I could record during the ride or if he minded, and he said, uh, yes, I do mind. I do mind. I do mind. I do mind. Um, but it's okay because he was a very cool guy. He was awesome. And uh, the good news is I passed. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> and so now, when I get home, I can take the uh, DB killer out and let this baby breathe. What are they doing in front of me? My goodness. All right, so I passed my test. I am now fully endorsed. And it feels great. It's a little weight lifted off my shoulder there. But now, since I'm an hour away from my house, and I don't know where the hell I am right now, um, <laughs> my cellular data is turned off, which is weird because I turned it back on to get the hell up here. And now when I went to put in my GPS, it says you do not have cellular data. And there's no Wi-Fi, so I can't even get on to my my phone provider to turn on cellular data. So now I have to just find where the hell I'm uh, supposed to be going. So this might take two hours to get home. And the Braps know all too well about my uh, <laughs> they know all too well about my cellular data issues because uh, I think part of the problem. I think part of the reason why my uh, why I had to turn cellular data off was because of them. Ugh. I'm just kidding, guys. So the problem is at my work, where where I work in our business, um, I'm right at the cutoff of getting clear Wi-Fi and not getting Wi-Fi at all. So constantly throughout the day, I would either be piggybacking off of Wi-Fi or I would be using my cellular data, and. I don't know about you, but if you're caught in the middle, it seems like it just eats it up like, just nom 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 nom. It just eats it all up. So, last month's bill, it was a little high, so I wanted to turn off cellular data so I could only use Wi-Fi, 
Um, but now that's screwed me because when I go to turn on cellular data, it's, it's like it doesn't want to stay on, even after I turn it back on. Like, I was able to get up here with GPS, but now going back home, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know, guys. So this will be a little adventure for me, trying to see if I can get home. Because I don't even know where I'm supposed to turn. Oh my god, I'm so lost. That's the worst, to be lost on a day where you don't want to be lost. I mean, I got the whole day off, but uh, I got shit to do. So I don't want to be just aimlessly wandering around in some little neighborhood completely lost. All right, so I'm gonna try just stopping up here, seeing if I can pick up anything, any kind of GPS or something. All right, I'll be back. All right, guys, I think I'm on the right track now. But damn it, I am hungry now. I didn't have any breakfast because I was so nervous to do this test. Oh, and by the way, let me explain this test to you guys. I was so worried that there was gonna be a course that I was gonna have to, you know, do uh, figure eights and uh, go in between cones, which I don't really have any doubt in my ability of doing that, but I don't know, it's, it felt more daunting to, to know that you're on like a closed course. And uh, I don't know, but anyway, so I get there and uh, it might have been recording when I was talking to the guy, but, um, Okay, now I'm going to have to find out where the hell I'm going. Just to be sure. Alright. Sunset Drive to... Jesus, I am so screwed up here. God, I hope I'm going the right way. Ah, damn it. Alright, I got to turn here. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. That was sunset. I needed sunset. Nice. All right. I think uh, I think I'm good from here, guys. Cool. I really wish I had Siri whispering in my ear again. All right, guys. So again, I don't know if my the beginning of my vlog even recorded, but if it did, then awesome. If it didn't, then you just joined in at a weird time, um, and I'll try to edit it together to make a little sense. <laughs> But thanks for coming with my journey today of uh, passing my Wisconsin motorcycle permit or actual endorsement and you watch it. Uh, but yeah, thanks for coming along guys. So until the next video, I will catch you guys later. Ride safe out here. Be safe. Have fun. I love you guys. Bye-bye.